Okay, so we've got 2x2, 3x3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, and 10. And probably some other 3x3s there. But yeah, there's something quite missing, and I don't exactly... Whoa. What's poppin' guys? And today we have an unboxing from Setsu Store. So anyways, let's get into it. Oh wait, so that's what we have. So we have the MF8, and we also have Setsu's Weight 1 in blue, so let's just get this thing out of the way. Okay, so we have again the lube, which this will go to my stock of lubes to use. And of course, we finally have it, the MF8 8x8. So let's get into it. Looks really nice and it's actually really compact compared to something like my average GTSM. They're almost about the same size. Okay, now that's really surprising. Now comparing to the MF9, it's really much smaller. And of course, of course, the Meilong 10x10. So the Meilong 10 is a lot bigger compared to the MF8. So, anyways, let's get into first turns. That's a little bit sandy, but it actually feels nice. I mean, it is a really small and pocket 8x8. I'm already kind of used to the how small the MF9 is, and I haven't tried any other 9x9 other than that. But I can tell you this 8x8 is really, really compact. They're not that bad. They remind me of the Little Magic 6 for some reason. Just a lot more sandier, scratcher, a bit more slower. Okay, it's starting to break in a little bit. Dang, this is feel nice. The shades are still, again, not that bad. Actually, they're just the regular, uh, the good old Moe shades, sticker shades. Corner cutting, yeah, I'd rather not corner cut, but it's quite limited. Of course, we expected with these cues. Yeah, I may have to adjust a little bit, and this especially needs some breaking in. Overall, dang, this is feel really small and really compact. I'm actually liking it a lot. Of course, this is gonna be my... <laughs> okay, now that is a... <sighs> well, considering it is an 8x8, so popping's definitely one big issue here. Okay, that kinda got fixed pretty easily. But of course, we'll have to fix this as well. <laughs> Whew. Okay, it's still the the PLO parity is quite manageable, but not the best. So, anyways, I got this eight by eight, so I can actually complete my two by two, three by three, four by four, five by five, six by six, seven by seven, and the eight by eight goes here, the nine by nine, and the ten by ten. Okay, so we have the one by one. Now that's just insane. So. Yeah, that's gonna be a lot of cubes I might be doing. Especially, yeah, again, I might be doing a really on this. So stay tuned for that. So, anyways, thank you guys so much for watching this unboxing. And I do hope I can be able to solve the relay soon. But of course, I'll do some solves on this too. And again, once again, thank you guys for so much for watching. And I will see you in the next video. Keep popping, guys. Peace. <laughs>